Direct access, Matt here. Right now I'm really focused on my new business, building my new business. The short stature and accessibility kit is really a custom design kit for everything you need in a hotel room if you're a little person. And, and that's just what I'm focused on is building that company into something um, substantial. I don't know that Amy's quite there with me yet in terms of uh, thinking that it has the potential that it does. So there's one, two, three orders in this group of um, voicemail. This is why Amy's always complaining about money. It's because, you know, it's like, well, it's all queued up in inventory. It's all in, you know, somewhere it's, in the it's queue, somewhere, somewhere in the chain, yeah. in the chain of command. So we need to free it up. Amy is a glasses half empty, you know, kind of person. And, um, I love her for it, but it's it's it can be challenging. Oh, hi. Bills. There's probably never going to be enough money for Amy to feel as secure as she wants. The stress on our marriage, finances, is a big one. I think our perspective is very different. Got my um, property tax bill, so I'm going to take care of that. Yeah. Okay. You paid in thirties. You want me to go ahead and pay one yeah. right now? That's up to you. You have the money. Absolutely, I got the money. What do you think I am? So if I just remember, February is when this is due again. <laughs> what? Uh, you're so funny. You're always worried about the future. No, I'm not. But it does come up quick. <coughs> After the holidays, I'm worried about bills. paying what's due now. I'm not worried about February. Well, that's your problem. You don't look to I've got the money for February. Don't worry about that, okay? I mean, it's all here. I can pay the I'm whole thing if I want to. I'm tired of just living for the moment. I'm not living for the moment. That's yes, why we are. are. <laughs> we don't rent. That's why we own a big million-dollar farm. It's because we're looking for the future. <laughs> you know, your, your farm yes. down there. We live on a 34-acre farm in Oregon. It's a very special place. <laughs> we have a elaborate tree house and a western town with tunnels underneath. Exactly. Awesome. <laughs> Pirate ship, which we just revamped this year, and a pond, and just tons of trails that go around it. We have a castle that we're uh, hoping to complete here in the near future. But we have a little bit of everything. Oh, no, 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 no.